All right, guys, welcome back to more Blade of Agony. We are going to be starting episode, uh, well, an episode, we're still in episode one. We're starting mission five, uh, Operation Paris. First thing we're going to do is heal up. And now I'm going to go get the last two vials here that we can get, Vitality Serum here. Get two more, and now we're maxed out at 150. So let's head on over here. We're going to drop off our Eisenman vials. And I would say this is my favorite map in episode one. We don't have to talk to Bertrand, but she'll just tell us that we'll be meeting up with her in the next mission. All right, let's drop off these files. All right, and if you take a look over here, Commander Keen's going on. That's pretty cool. You can't do anything, but it's pretty cool. Let's go and uh, start this thing. All right, so we're going to Gay Paris, and uh, yes, we are going to be meeting up with Bertrand. She set up the resistance, and we'll be defending a Nibblewerfer. So we got a lot to do, and let's pet the dog for luck. And let's go. Alright, so we start out here, and we're going to jump into the sewers. Let's go in here. First couple Nazis, just get rid of them like that. Nice and easy. Flip that switch. And now we can dive into this gross water. And we'll just go, go, go. I'm always afraid I'm going to run out of air. As long as you keep moving, you should be fine. And turn to the left here, and we're gonna find a tunnel. It's a little hard to see, but you just gotta keep on going. Come on, go, 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 go. Okay, and just keep going until we find this ladder. And now we're out of here, all right. So we got the resistance right over here. And this is really neat how it was done. Um, you go over here, look at the mirror, break it. It's behind you. Open the picture, flip that switch. And this opens up. We need um, an occult key to open that. We'll be getting that uh, in a bit. All right, and here she is. Alright, grab the green key, 
and we're just gonna leave this uh, yeah we'll save that food oh I think there might be uh, that's food and ammo. I'm gonna save that there I'll definitely be coming back for it. and same thing with this I think this is ammo yep all right so with our green key we may leave now our first thing uh, they're gonna try to blow up a bridge we need to stop it so No time to dawdle, just go. Just go, just go. Oh, I don't want to hit any friggin' mines. <laughs> yeah, we don't have a whole lot of time here. We just gotta disarm that. And I like to go back this way. This is the safest spot. Alright, now we got some guys to deal with. Uh, let's see, there's a guy right up there. And then him. And then we also have a rifle dude up here. So we only have three secrets in this map. First one is right here. Um, I'm anticipating this map to take uh, maybe 40 minutes, something like that. Our second secret is up this ladder. Now, I can never do this without getting hurt. Just run in. Well, I can never leave without getting hurt. <laughs> Running in is fine. Getting out is something else. Go, go. <laughs> okay, so that's why I saved all that health back at the... Um, back in here. Next thing we gotta do, well, let's get rid of you. There's another one. Alright, there's gonna be a sniper up above us. Alright. Uh, what I want to do is I want to get the Sten. I like to have that nice and early. Let's go over this way. And we'll jump into the water. It is... That is uh, armor. And then there it is. Okay, cool. And now we'll go this way, and I'm going to try to get a hold of a flamethrower. That would be quite nice if I could, if they would drop me one. Usually they do, sometimes they don't. Um, but the flamethrower is really going to come in handy once we reach the catacombs. So... And did you drop one? No, he didn't. Considering I, I guess I blew him up. Oh. No, he didn't drop one either. You're dropping me fuel for it, but you're not dropping me an actual flamethrower. <laughs> well, that's not cool. We got guys here. And then we have a sniper up there. Very careful.
All right, this area is optional, but it's nice to come in because you get, um, yeah. Oh man, they're not, they're not helping me out at all. Uh, at least I didn't have to blow up his friggin' toilet. He did it himself. The only good Nazi toilet is a broken one. Let's go. Unfortunately, we did not get a flamethrower, but... It is what it is. Okay, so let's go in here, and we're going to have a boss, a mini-boss, uh, along with some rats, which is really annoying. Ugh. Wasting ammo. That's what they do. He's not a very difficult boss, but those rats can really... They just get in the way, that's all. <laughs> Alrighty then, we can leave. Again, empty handed with the flamethrower, but that's alright. We'll deal with it. Uh, in here. Oh, almost forgot about that. All right, let's grab the ammo and moving on. Let's go into the hotel. Why am I stuck? I usually go that way. Come on. There we go. Here to you, quick. Okay. Get a safe spot and go, go, go. Urgh. Okay, we just got some guys to clean up here. And we have another boss. Uh, he is around the corner. It looks like I got some a good amount of shells here. I should be able to get rid of them quick. I like to throw that, weaken them. There we go, holy shit. He let off that friggin' grenade as soon as I stepped in there, of course. That's all right, didn't get hurt too bad. But now we have another group of guys right here. Let's drop that and they should all go bye-byes. That's, that's one of my French crullas I let them have there. BJ, BJ Krella. All right, and then we have Doggo. Nice, grenades. We definitely want to have lots of grenades on hand. Step up here, go in here, and now we are going to be surrounded. More SS, and there's a turret guy off to the right. So, uh, yes, be careful, of course. Urgh. I think I shot the friggin' water fountain there. Come on around, I don't want to friggin'... There's one. There's two. There's... Oh, shit. Those guys, they can definitely take a take a shot or two. Sheesh. Didn't know there was another one. Oh, really? You're still alive? Holy crap. There we go, finally. All right, that usually goes a little smoother. That's okay, though. Let's go around this way and grab some health. We need the cyan key for that. And I'll be using this. Usually I get a hold of a rifle by now, too. I don't know. Maybe not. I don't remember. Okay, cool. We got an MP40. I'm thinking bigger guys like this, they should be carrying... This should be like an STG guy in this game, I'm telling you. I think that would have been... That would have been a nice touch. 
I guess I just missed that weapon, that's all. All right, let's go out here. This was the sniper that we saw near the start. You definitely want to come up here because, well, as you can see, we get a Panzer Shrek. And we have those two guys. And there's the Cyan Key. Let's grab that health. And with our Cyan Key, we may now use Le Cyan Door and hit that switch. Now down here, um, I think it kind of tricky. Oh, we got friggin' rats. We're gonna be dealing with some mutants and they're pain in the ass as usual. And what's gonna happen is we're gonna grab those Eisenman files or get close to it anyway, and they're just gonna burst out. Now, if you're not ready for it, they can they can really ruin your day. Uh, but as long as you're ready, you should be able to dodge. Uh, oh man, I thought uh, I thought I killed more guys than I had. I guess. Oh well. Yeah, destroy that stuff. Grab the files. Open this up. Yeah, usually I can get out of that with a lot less damage taken. That's all right. Um, we got some bandages up here. And a health. Nice. Okay. We're going to go this way now. And, oh, good. A big health. And a shovel, because shovels are awesome. And now we're down in the catacombs. Now this area can be kind of, um, you know, they're kind of a pain in the ass ambush thing. Eh, I dislike it, but uh, you know, let's use, oh man, I really wish I had gotten a hold of a flamethrower. That, that's pretty helpful in this area. What I'm gonna do, do that, get rid of this asshole. Flip that switch, go, go, go. Get the hell out, get, 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 get. Fucking ghost, man. Fuck. Go. Goddamn bats, man. Wow. That was awful. <laughs> and now that door opens up, of course. Oh, man. Usually, um... Oh, well. What the hell was I doing? I need to heal up. Yeah, I dislike that part. I just, um, I have a mixed, um, sometimes I get out of that with very little damage. Other times it's like that. I just almost die. It's, it's ridiculous. Let's see if there's any more health over here before I continue. I'm using some bandages, as you can, as you may or may not be able to see. Whoops, I keep doing that. Use the frickin' bandit, okay. Is there anything left up here? No, the coffee machine's busted. I couldn't use it anyway. Anything left? No. <laughs> oh, there's some French food right there. Yeah, we should be all right. Just keep on moving. Besides, you know how I like to do this, you guys. I keep things dangerous. Down the hole again. 
I don't even know why I'm going this way. I guess I'm just trying to uh, go like I would if I if this hadn't been so such a pain in the ass. Okay, we're gonna go and jump into the water now. I don't think there's anything else. Jump into the water. And you'll see we're going to end up back outside. Try not to hit any mines. <laughs> uh, go, go, go. Yeah, it's been 20 minutes already. I don't even think we're halfway through this map either. I'd say yeah, maybe a little under halfway. Next stop we're going to do is... Um, What do I want to do? I want to... Oh, yes. I got to go back to the hideout. Because we got the occult key. And that key is going to fit into this. And again, flamethrower would really be helpful in this area. Friggin' Nazis had to be such Nazis about giving me a friggin' flamethrower. It's just awful. Uh, ah. Well, that helped. Okay, and up here, we need another occult key. Oh, god damn it. Friggin' bats. Hit that switch. That way leads out. Uh, did I did I hit the switch already? I thought I thought I did. No, okay, yeah, I did. Okay, um, go this way. There's gonna be more critters. Fastest way to get rid of them is just use the grenade. I think there's, yeah, 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 friggin' bats. Oh, my dear lord. And they take so much damage, too. It's like, damn, they're just bats. God. Damn it. So if we look over here, here's the other key. You look over there, there's a whole bunch of rats. And what I'm going to do is toss one of those and blow them all up. That gets rid of them. One fell swoop. Alright, next thing we got to do is open up that little gate over there. The way we do that... It is underwater, and I can never seem to remember which side it's on. I'm pretty sure it's over here. Somewhere over here. Maybe not. It's along that wall. I know that much. There it is. Alright. Nice ammo. Be nice if there was health in here, but oh well. Dive back down after hitting that switch and you'll see that. It opened up. 
Grab that. Nothing nothing happens. No monsters pop out or nothing. Grab the treasure. And we got the half. Yes, that's half of the solar disk. We'll be getting the other half later. And what we want to do now is head back this way and up these stairs. Nope, not these stairs. Uh, this, here they are. These stairs, um, insert that. Hit that, and you'll see this opens up. Okay, this area. Um, I'm going to use this. Grab some health. going to be my uh, guys. Get rid of them quick. Get rid of them quick. Er, her, her. All right, and then the guy over here. All right, so I want to take out whatever guys I can from down here. So we got this guy. Please die, thank you. And then there's another one, there he is. You frickin' guy. And where's the last one? Where is he? I know he's up there. Did I kill him? I don't think I killed him. Well, I can't sit here all day, so let's go. Oh, now, oh, you freaking prick. Thank you. Okay, moving on. Blue dudes. Uh, I gotta be careful. There is a, um... Just didn't want to shoot it with myself right next to it, that's all. Okay, so we destroyed this. And that was our goal. So let's head back out. We're going to have guys coming for us, of course. As always. Really? You guys didn't drop a rifle. All right, well, let's go down here and we'll get our third and last secret. Whoops, it's all right. <laughs> All right, for whatever reason, just stepping on that uh, counts as the secret. So we'll grab grenades and we'll go back up. Okay, in here. Yeah. We alerted a boss. No rifle still, man. That's that's not. That's not um, 
good. I mean, it's not bad either, but it's definitely not ideal. So with a well-placed shot, we can get rid of this guy in one blast. All right, let's grab some treasure here, some coins. Back down. Up here. And what we're going to do now is get. I'll hit this switch. And we got these guys, that guy there. And now um, we'll grab that key, and doggos are going to pop out. So. Go, go, go. Ah. Shit. Usually I can run out here and then turn around and get them easily. Man, it's because I'm recording. It's always because I'm recording, right? That's why it never goes smoothly. Fortunately, there is a large health to pick up. I may just save it, though. I don't think it would be worth getting the large health right now. Uh, it is around, I think it's around this way. Yeah, it's right there. When I need it, I will come back here and get it. Right, what I want to do now is go through the purple door. Purple door right here. I'd say we're good 60% done with this map. Oh, right. We are in the casino now, and this area is really neat. Kitty Kellerman. I don't know if that's a real figure that, uh, or what, but I do remember seeing uh, half man, half woman doing a tango with himself or something. I don't freaking know. It was really... Oh, you prick. It was a while ago, and I, I just can't remember exactly, but... There it is. I'll be muting the music that that is uh, singing because I don't want to deal with uh, friggin' um, with copyright claims, which I have no doubt. would happen. I don't want to kill... I don't want to kill it. Yeah, interesting. Okay, and... We'll go this way up here. We'll have more friggin' guys. Now this part's really cool. We have this uh, Hitler portrait here. and His eyes follow us as we go back and forth. <laughs> I do. That never gets old. I love doing that. All right. Hit that switch. This opens up with another boss. A mini boss. Reload. Ah, Zephyr will be proud, huh? Of what, your friggin' failure? Um, we're gonna get behind this picture in a moment. Right now, let's just focus on uh, not dying. A rifle would be very helpful right now. I 
Man, they have been very, very stingy with dropping weapons. Because, yeah, I'm usually... Uh, I'm usually well equipped with a rifle by now from... Uh, from the area with the last secret. Oh, now I got a rifle. A day late and a dollar short there, rifle. All right, let's go. Uh, where is he? There you are. And smash. There's the blue key. All right, we are almost done. Yeah, I'd say we're 75% done now. Okay, so let's open up the back of Hitler's eyes. And so there it is. Open up this gray door. Uh, you can't get him, unfortunately. <laughs> All right, and then we're going to have a rifle guy up here. Let's try not to let him hit us. All right, we're going to climb this ladder. Go around this way. Oh, cool. We got the Mauser. Not really going to be using the scoped part in this map, but that's all right. So we flipped that switch, and now this is opened up. And we can go back here and grab the chest key. So let's go get the chest. Um, yes. Was there something over there? Uh, no, I thought that might have been shells or something. Okay, so we can exit using the door that is somewhere over here. Ooh, shells. No, not that way. There it is. All right, so we're back outside. And what we can do now is go into this bank area. Now, this is another optional area. But you can make some pretty good money by doing it. you all right and that there's really not that many guys in here looks like we're full on shells and we're full on health nice those guys oh usually they don't come out some gold now before I go we can open this but before I go that way I'm gonna go collect the yellow key yellow key is gonna help us uh, open up the big safe and doggos Let 
this just kind of circles around. Doesn't really matter what door you go through. <laughs> and here it is. All right, cool. Now grab shells, grab ammo. Let's go open up that big safe and then we can wrap up this map. All right, we go down here. and we're gonna open this up and what I found I really don't want to use my rocket launcher in here because it's just such a close range I don't want to blow myself up Alright, so that's the end of him, and we got all this gold here, but we can't get it unless we destroy the money bags. So let's do that. Besides, it's fun making it confetti. Confetti money. Uh, there's nothing else, nothing else. Alright, onward. Ah, uh, there was a big health, wasn't there? Was it back in Kitty Kellerman's area? I think it was. It was back in Kitty Kellerman's area. Can't believe I'm even saying that, but whatever. Kitty Kellerman. Oh, food. Shells. And we're going to go straight across. Ah, here's health here anyway. We're fine. Let's go in here. Oh, wait. That's Kitty Kellerman. We're going to go over this way. Last area, guys. Last area. This is a good 85% done, I'd say. This is definitely an interesting area, too. This is, um... There's lots to look at in here. Now, I don't... I don't know if these are actual, um... Posters. Or what, but... It really is cool. And you got these little figurines down here. You can't destroy them, unfortunately. I don't know what that number means, but you got that. And in here, the best part, we got that. That stuff, uh, I don't know what that says. And there's that. Now in here, what I like to do, because I don't like being in there with um, the female Uber sold at, I am going to uh, hit and run here. Shit. Yeah, apparently she's um, afraid of stairs or something. She can't go down steps. Her shotgun blast, though, holy crap, does that thing hurt. A little bowling there. All right, so we are pretty much done. Uh, let's grab shells. Oh, he was still alive. Still alive, that's what you get. Okay. And we got these guys. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. 
Man, still no flamethrower. Not fair, man, not fair. There's the red key. And now we can get the hell out of here. But this is the toughest part in the map. It's another, well, it's the kind of thing that I, I like it, but I don't like it. On this difficulty setting, it is extremely difficult. Um, and here's what's going to happen. I'm actually going to save it right now. Okay, so what's going to happen... So what's going to happen is we're going to grab the other half of that and a whole ton of Nazis are going to show up and they're going to try to destroy the, um, the Nibblewerfer. And ideally what, what's going to happen is I can just use the, the, the um, MG42, I guess that's what it's called, and just tear them down. Um, but man, it, it's just... Um, I don't think I'm going to survive my first few tries, so we just got to move. There they come. Now, it's a bit annoying because when you get shot while riding, while on this thing, it pushes you back. God damn. I really want to destroy. Damn. Did I get the boss? I can't remember. I don't know if I killed him or not. Apparently not. Awesome. What I'm going to do is retreat back. Ah, yeah, it's time to go. I'm going to run back to this other gun. And hopefully what will happen is they'll stay in line. Because what, what they'll do, they, they, they stay in a line. And I can just tear them down like this. But what will happen sometimes, too, is they will go off to the sides, and that's when I end up losing control. So if I end up dying, which uh, is very possible I will, um, I will definitely just show you the finished product.
All right, so reinforcements are here. As you can see, uh, they are fighting off the rest of them. The problem is uh, there is friendly fire, so we really need to get out of their way as soon as they show up. Otherwise, yeah, it's uh, it doesn't look good for us. <laughs> they will kill us. So there is going to be a tank. So once there's one left, I'm just going to bring out my remaining rockets here and just uh, destroy it with this. Unless they're able to destroy it themselves. I don't know. What the hell? Oh, that's the... Yeah, okay. This guy, this tank is a pain in the ass. Sometimes these guys, um... Sometimes these guys do destroy it. Holy shit. It's not very often, but it is possible they'll destroy it. And that's it. Okay. All right, mission over. Holy crap. Awesome mission, but that last one, that last part is kind of a pain in the neck.